So <laughs> roll it. I don't. I don't remember why he went after me. If there was a specific like, or we were. May, oh, I think it was pretty much the I, moment you got banned on YouTube. Keemstar decided it, he was. It was fair game to just like talk. Yeah, and nonstop. I thought it was pretty funny how he got real comfortable the minute we went on break. Yeah. Like, a lot of the characters came out the woodwork and all of a sudden <laughs> felt really comfortable to say whatever they wanted about me and my family in this case. So yeah, Keemstar, basically one day after we started break, Ethan Klein's father from H3 um, is trying to take basically... My dad, by the way, is like the most woke libtard of all time. I mean, he is so far left socially and politically it's kind of laughable, but Keemstar is trying to take him out of context to prove that I'm somehow a hypocrite or something, or that my dad is a racist. Somebody said, what a discouraging day. I have terrible luck with airports and cops. Pulled over and written up four times for offenses. My dad said, and you don't even look black. Of course, look, my dad is a moron. I wouldn't type that. But obviously his joke is that black people get, you know, targeted more. Right. Um, but he's a boomer. This is from 2017. So I guess Keemstar realized that he, he had already come through all of my tweets, and then he's like, I can go through Gary's tweet <laughs> and try to embarrass Ethan. Also, he kind of has a thing for messing with the elderly. He's done it in the past as right. well. Oh, right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. Good right, point. Right. It's only a matter of time before he accused so my dad of being a P-word. Right. 2017, did he, was he just like scrolling and scrolling and scrolling through Gary's He's like, I'm yeah. Here. He's like, yeah. I'm yes. Fuck up this old man's Christmas. You'll see. Yes, that's literally what he was doing. <laughs> Weird. So he goes, Ethan Klein, fathers from H3 podcast, which, and like, let's be honest, it's not even that good of a find, bro. It's just kind of weird and pathetic, don't you think? Team oh, Star, shut totally. up. To be tweeting out like deep, weird con cuts from my dad. But, but also, obviously, he knows what that, he's not making a racist comment. Also, I mean, whatever your dad is saying is not you saying it. Why, why are we even focusing on your dad's Twitter from a few years ago? He's not even a public figure. <laughs> That's like, two likes. This tweet. <laughs> yeah, two likes. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he probably had like two fo or like five followers or something back then. But not that it matters. He didn't say anything racist. It's just... So, yeah, Ethan Klein's father from HGG Podcast. Um... There was something that led up into this. I can't remember what. Bonus found by Nicholas Diorio. Shout out. Um, can you put up a picture of Nick while we read this one found by him? Sure. One second. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. But wait, it didn't start with this stuff. It started with him talking to like porn accounts, no? There, it's all in here. Okay. Um, this is Nicholas Diorio. Okay, hold on. I, I'm going to do t this in two steps. Here's how Nicholas Diorio depicts himself on the internet. Right. It's some kind of. He doesn't show his face. Well, he does. He just not on his channel. And then um, this is like Keen's uh, heir to a drama alert, apparently, because he was posting uh, videos on the drama alert channel. Here's what we're dealing with here. Well, besides him just being like a child, he's like so, I mean, he looks like he's barely out of high school or still in high school. I mean, he's a young dude. Yeah, this is what I mean. Yeah. You argue with people on the internet and you get charged up and you've got to realize that you're probably talking to someone that looks like this. <laughs> and what I mean by that is a pimply faced kid who, you know, what? he's just, he's a know nothing. Yeah. These are the people, you got to remember what's going on on the internet. Like, if I met this kid in real life, I would literally just, you wouldn't think twice about him. Yeah, I mean, this is Nicholas Diorio. <laughs> yeah. That's a good one, Avery. With, <laughs> with that, um, <laughs> with that, uh, uh, Weekend at Burn. what was it, Weekend at Bernie's, what's that movie? Uh, yeah, Weekend at Bernie's. And again, not, um, <clears throat> listen. Cool guy. N exactly. So this is the kind of person that uh, is a tough guy on the internet, you know. So shout out to, shout out to, uh, at least Keemstar shows his face, and you can you can goof on him for his face. Oh, right. AB is saying he's 24, 
Really? I thought he looked like 17. Maybe yeah. it's the older photos we saw where he was... Maybe. This one is from... It says... This is relatively recent. Like within the last okay, year. He looks so. older in this one. He yeah, he looks look a little older. bit older. That's yeah. true. But anyway, my point is, you know, it's like... Yeah. So anyway, shout out to Nicol Nicholas Diorio for shout for digging saying, up dirt on my dad. Who's body shaming anyone? I'm seeing people. I literally didn't even comment on his body. You guys, you guys are projecting a little bit here. I didn't say a single freaking comment. Well, I guess about you said that he was body. pimply. What? You said that he was pimply. I guess is that body shaming? No. Yeah. Pimples. Saying he has pimples. We all had pimples. It's my part point is that like, he's a child. A that he's a child. Yes. Yeah. Okay, guys, am I not, get, let me ask you something. Am I not allowed to talk about anybody who's over, like, what is your point? I didn't make you a single allowed. comment you about his body. Shut the fuck up. Yeah. Shut the fuck up. Then nobody's allowed to talk shit about me. I'm fat. Don't <laughs> say anything about me. Draw, Dollar Tree scarce, exactly. <laughs> guys, I didn't body shame him. Come on. Not a single comment about his body. He's youthful. He's got pimples. He looks like a child. I mean, what the hell? I know. I already see the hell. Ethan is a hypocrite. He is body shaming Nicholas Diorio. Uh, gave <laughs> try, him the best to gift of the year. What? <laughs> I said they're going to, he fed the birds. They're going to have videos for weeks now. <laughs> well, whatever. Yeah, I don't and care. Nobody yeah. watching. It's not like the. Nobody watches. Either it. way, there's going to be videos, so whatever. No, I don't care, but I just want to let it be known that I am not body shaming him, and I never said a single freaking peep about his body, so don't be acting like I body shamed you, bro. Thank you. All bodies are beautiful, Nick. Okay. I mean... Well, why don't we show what the Oreo sent to Kimstar? So, let's see. Um, are you at least eight? Wait, what is this? Oh, this, wait, what? These are wait, these are super out of order, dude. Like, this is Keemstar being creepy on his man because I know he accused my dad of being creepy, but these are all old Keemstar tweets. Yeah, everything, Keemstar. everything about your dad should be in that first, that first link. Is and there then, more? And I didn't see it. Yeah, there's more. There's oh, okay, more. Oh, okay, I didn't know that. Okay, so, got it. So, shout out, bonus found by Nicholas Diorio. Are you more enthusiastic with your... I can't read it because it's cut off. Let me see, maybe... Is it down here? Let's see. Um. Oh, yeah, here it is. Are you more enthusiastic with your BJs there? Disappointing still because you're so far... That's disgusting. <laughs> I mean, and what's... Well, first of all... My dad is a disgusting. I can't believe he was writing those comments on Twitter. That is just so freaking embarrassing. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Boomer. What a, oh my God. God. So disgusting. But here's the thing that they don't, they don't get is that I am calling my dad out for being a creep consistently. I oh, know. Like, I don't know. First, you, you did it on the show with them. We counted literally how many porn accounts you followed <laughs> yeah. on Twitter. So they think they're doing something. It's like, maybe you should just admit that you're a fan and you watch the show. Because <laughs> we already did this. But yeah, that's disgusting. I mean, I agree. Just wait till we look at your tweets, Keemstar. But wait, this was, I feel like we're not remembering the context. Because what was this following? He was trying to say that your dad is a creep because we were talking about someone else. I agree. There was what was context. it? Context. Bro, I don't, I don't even remember. Does any of you guys remember? We were talking about someone um, that was actually doing something creepy, <coughs> maybe? Or or was it just Kimstar, maybe? Yeah. About him dating Let me dating children. Girls? Oh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I made a joke about right. Kimstar dating a... 20 year old right and then he's like really well your dad was comic on a on a 20 year old porn stars account or something yeah. well i think we'll get there to it right it's a little out of order uh so uh, this is a picture of a girl posting herself with my face over it your ass does not look busted well see he's just being a sweetheart there isn't he <laughs> 2014. He thinks that this is... Dude, nobody's embarrassed by this. I talk about it. My dad doesn't care. 
Smash that like button. <laughs> I mean, I wish he didn't. I keep calling him out for it, and he doesn't stop. Well, this is from 2014. I think he stopped, probably. Yeah, this, this is yeah. really old. I think he didn't know even that it was public. No, definitely not. Yeah. Uh, Ethan Klein from H3 Podcast keeps bringing up that I dated a 20-year-old oh, yeah. okay, as some kind of own when his own father publicly simps for girls in their 20s. Bro, are you really dumb to think that that's, first yeah. of all, the same? First of all, you're talking about my dad, who I, I already call out for being a creep, versus you actively being in a relationship with I a know. girl who just finished high school Someone who has and spring. Braces. Yeah, who has literally it's, it's like has braces has in their braces, mouth. Dude. But it's like, yeah, I don't get it. Your your dad is not trying to date anyone. <clears throat> no. In fact, he's only consuming their service. Yes. They put themselves out there for that purpose. And, and he is on, on a public forum and he's engaging with it. And it's not to say that we like that he's doing that. We've told him about it many times not to do it. And I think he's learned. But... This is not the wait, same. Wait, 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 wait. This girl is 26. <laughs> She's not even like, dude, you're, okay, that's. But it's not, it's just not the same. I, so when girls put up porn, is there an age limit of who is supposed to watch it or interact with it? It's 18 plus. No, no, no. But no, I don't I think. I mean, your I dad think... is technically, like you said, consuming He's their consuming service. He's a product that, that she's put out there. He's not trying to actually be with her in person. Yeah. It's such a sad, but and also I didn't do it. Keemstar, uh, I, oh God, there, I could go in on him so hard, but it's just below the. I'm so fucking angry. I'm so fucking angry. <laughs> I mean, you say what you will about my dad, but at least he didn't fucking leave me in a dumpster behind a fire station. <laughs> Let's fucking go. <laughs> Wait, okay. I'm just saying, like, if you want to go after my dad, then it's all on the table, right? <laughs> I mean, bro, this guy texted him. He messaged you <laughs> two years in a row on Christmas, <laughs> talking shit about your wife, saying he slept with your wife, uh, talking about your son, talking about your father. With peace and love, I'm going to be quiet now. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, GameStar tried to... No, he's trying to say my dad's a creep. He's, no, okay, at least on. he's in my life. Thanks for reminding me, AB. He tried to say that me and him were like... Oh, yeah, he tried to make a rumor that you slept with him when he was doing our podcast. Yeah, it's not and that all... I slept with him, it's that he fucked me, you know? It's like oh, yeah. more degrading. Right, right. It's not that he... I slept with him, it's oh, they were... he got me. Him and Leaf, and, you know, um, little lackeys like Nicholas Diorio. And our was... son is technically his son, which is... Yeah. Like, I've never puked in my whole life, but this might make me puke, Keemstar. <laughs> yeah, exactly. The guy's total scum. <laughs> but like I'm just making saying, me lightheaded. he's going to attack my dad, right? I could at least defend my dad by saying he didn't abandon me right. in a fucking gift basket to, uh, you know, the neighborhood uh, orphanage. <laughs> I mean, I'm just being real. If we're gonna talk about each other's fathers, like, my dad has a lot of shortcomings, but he didn't fucking leave the family. Neither did my mom, by the way. I mean, I think that's fair to say. Is it too, is it below the belt? And I can't wait I mean, to- I, If you're saying it with the point that it doesn't make sense to go after each other's fathers. Like, yeah. I, that if, is if, my if, point. If, if he has a point- If, if he, he wants to say you, who's the worst dad, I mean, right. you know? I'm sorry. I gotta I defend my dad here. <laughs> You think my dad didn't want to leave the family? <laughs> Believe but me, he did. stuck it through. <laughs> <laughs> Not once! <laughs> <laughs> Animals die! Don't feel bad for Keemstar. He's actually the trashiest, worst human being ever. He literally tried to make a rumor that people were believing that he, quote, fucked Ela when he was here doing the podcast. And he made multiple videos, just, he made like, TikToks it about it, all of his... Sick to my stomach did. to just hear that. He reported that Leafy made a video saying he fucked... He was actually trying to make it a thing. Yeah, and his, his followers w kept trying to make it a thing. <laughs> While also calling you a horse. So yeah. That, so she's gross, but I fucked her anyway. <laughs> yeah, he's disgusting. Yeah. He's gone after my dad, my wife. And I love how these, this gang that talks shit nonstop is going to act so sensitive now. I can't believe what Ethan said. Right. I am so outraged that Ethan would make fun oh of Keemstar for being an orphan. Orphan. <laughs> Cobra Kai, baby. No fucking mercy.
not playing. <laughs> well, I, I really don't care. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm ready to join Cobra Kai. <laughs> <laughs> Sweep the fucking wow. leg. Sweep the fucking Listen, leg. Listen, he made fun of my fucking dad. I wish I could make fun of his dad. I just don't know who he is. And sadly, neither does he. <laughs> I mean, oh, we're not <laughs> fucking around this year. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying. It's and it's not it's not Kim's fault. It's his dad's fault for being a deadbeat. Yeah. There you go. That's that's important to say. Yeah, it's Kim not has Kim lots Star's of failings, fault. but I mean, being, being an orphan is one of them. Yeah, and you can't blame the kids for what their parents did. It's yeah. not his fault he was left like a fucking... Where's your daddy? <sighs> Where, is daddy? Where is his daddy? <laughs> <laughs> Brutal. Uh... Yeah, where is his daddy? So anyway, that's basically that. <laughs> so anyway, H three H three from it keeps bringing up that I dated twenty year old, but his dad watches porn. Can you believe that? <laughs> Fucking oh, dude, your girlfriend has braces. It's over. Like, why? Just don't bring up any of this. Like, if you're <laughs> dating a girl with braces, just don't go there. Cause... Right. Right. <laughs> Who, by the way, you pretended was your assistant for a long time. Right, which because everyone Because you were too embarrassed <laughs> to admit you were fucking a girl that literally graduated from high school yesterday. <laughs> Did I know that? He was pretending. Yeah. Yeah. That's <laughs> he got her his assistant for like six months. I fucked up! <laughs> Probably closer to my dad's age than your girlfriend. Be more uh, it would be more appropriate maybe. for you to be in a relationship with my dad than your girlfriend. That might actually be true. <laughs> By the way, I just want to clarify, you know, nothing wrong with, first of all, orphans, not their fault. <laughs> right. Every kid deserves loving parents. It's just a horrible, tragic thing. So I don't I want, you know, I have a lot of respect for people that grow up in the system. It's hard. It's a messed up, crazy hard life. And, you know, for that experience, I actually do have sympathy for Keemstar and anyone that grows up in those conditions. And, you know, it, it's a horrible situation. So, just trying to make... make you're trying to make the point mm -hmm. that if you're comparing that. Yeah. I got you. Okay. Just saying. Just saying. My dad can beat up your dad, considering... <laughs> well, my dad's good at shadow boxing, is my point. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> I didn't get it. <laughs> oh, oh my god. My god. Oh my god. Can't lie. god. I can't, can't lie. That was a good joke. Good one, Ethan. Oh. Damn, dude. <laughs> People are typing, Dear Susan. Dear Susan. <laughs> oh, yeah. Do we have the. That might not be on. Let's uh, not start right. this year with a oh, band. There we go. There it is. Yeah, let's start it <laughs> off with a band. Good. I can get back to my H3 TV. <laughs> the Here other H3 TV. Today, I went after Ethan's dad, Gary. I, Ethan's dad is a bad dad. He watches porn and leaves comments on Twitter. Nothing like me. And then he said that I was left on a porch in a bread basket. At the fire station. Actually, that's just a lie. That's defamation. I was left at a uh, church. <laughs> anyway. I hit a dog this Christmas. It's been a rough year. <laughs> True story. True story. Like right, let's get on with it. <laughs> it's too late in the day for this shit. <laughs> We should uh, wrap it up. We got food waiting for us. So because it was good and got good reviews from normal... Oh, this is this is unrelated. <laughs> Meanwhile, uh, An Anis Aniston residents... Wait, this is, this is unrelated. Whatever, it's just what a picture. Happening? Oh, and that yoga position is called... Okay, who cares? Um, oh, yeah, they're trying to prove that my dad's racist. Uh, Tucker, if the NFL owners are racist, why are 70% of their employees black? My dad said... If slave owners are racist, then why are all their employees black? Which, you know, makes sense, right? He's make, again saying, it doesn't mean just because their employees are black that they can't be racist. Right, he's pointing out obvious. the irony. Yeah, obvious. Very obvious. So they started clipping just this, right? Yeah. And then trying to show that my dad's a racist. 
Um, if slave owners are racist, then why are all the... Yeah, which out of context is just kind of weird and doesn't make any sense. He also follows this account that mainly posts 18-year-old girls. Dude, it's porn stars. What do you want? You're actually fucking an 18 year old with braces who literally had to get a permission slip from her mom to, <laughs> to go, go on, on a, a date. field trip to your house. We don't know that it's 18, but okay. Hi, Ethan Klein's dad, uh, and he's tagging him. Like, what the fuck? Who harasses someone's boomer parent? Mm -hmm. He's literally tagging my dad and harassing him on Twitter. <laughs> Well, like AB said, he's he's got but a history of going all, after. He doesn't like old It's people, like so. this whole thing or is women. way more pathetic, knowing that you have already addressed it on the show. You've talked Many about times. it. So it's like, what do you want? People know about my problems with my dad. Yeah. Um. Hi, Ethan Klein's dad. This girl messaged him because my dad. We because of the extensive conversations we had on yeah. the podcast. She said, "Hi, I'm your biggest fan." Oh, maybe I should scroll down because I'm not. I don't think I'm seeing it. This is. Hi, I'm your biggest fan. This is thank you for supporting women who choose sex work and not putting us down, but empowering us all by watching you on your podcast and cameo. Turn, take it off the screen for a sec. Okay. I think he left a comment. Here, here, here here's the damning evidence. You're welcome. <laughs> oh no! Actually, the biggest crime is that he misspelled your. <laughs> no, I'm no, not. Actually no, actually not. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> you are welcome. Retake that, Ethan. <laughs> Um, murderer, <laughs> murderer. Yeah. So you got him, guys. Got him. You're welcome. Damn. Crazy. Cavos, another Keemstar lackey. You think Klein's dad bloody loves it? Let's see. There's a name I haven't heard in a long time. Cavos. What happened to that guy? These... Does he still make content? I I don't know. I literally haven't heard that name in like two years. You can see her nude doing lesbian stuff if you search well. <laughs> Piper, I mean. <laughs> Wait, where's the one he's... Okay, so... Oh, we already saw this one, but... What is this in reference to? My dad said, I think your boobs are crooked. I mean, dude, what are you doing? He's such a dumbass. Why did he... Why would you say that? That's just... That's kind of mean. I mean, I don't have the context. Well, yeah, you don't have... Maybe the picture was like... Oh, yeah. I, Just to make, give him the benefit of the doubt. It doesn't make doubt. sense that my dad would leave me in calm. No, yeah. Um, <laughs> so I'm going to give him the benefit of the doubt because I don't think he would just be like, nice boo nice crooked boobs, lady. Yeah. Like, you can see her. I, this one's pretty funny. You can see her nude and doing lesbian stuff <laughs> if you search well. <laughs> Wait, that was your dad? That that? Yeah, that was my dad, of course. <laughs> well, he's giving, giving advice. Yeah, search well, my friend. <laughs> Dad, what the hell? It's just so funny to me. Like this group of like twenty-year-old guys is just all teaming up on this old man and like, tagging him. <laughs> and tagging, and him. tagging him. Yeah, like antagonizing him. I'm sorry, you guys. Okay, that's it. So I mean, you know, luckily my dad was pretty unbothered by it, but you know, they try. They were trying to really. Mm -hmm. I think a lot of people can't imagine would be your dad overwhelmed a by fuck that about this. attention. Does he? Was he? Would he even have been aware of it if you hadn't like asked him about it? No, he was aware of it. He okay. was responding to them and shit. Oh, I think he, he told us about it. It was like Kim starts trying to come after me. <laughs> <laughs> he was respond. He was trying to be like because they were trying to paint him as a racist, which isn't cool. And he was like, look at the contacts. He was just leaving comments and stuff, but it didn't really take off in the drama sphere just because it was so obviously but keemstar made like a drama alert about my dad too didn't he ab um, like, pretty sure he mentioned my he dad who cares about that well exactly it's like, <laughs> like gary klein <laughs> <laughs> that's not you can't clickbait gary klein sorry <laughs> probably why we went back to just talking shit about pokemon all the time i don't hate women I think they had like a schedule while we were on break. Let's start with the old men, then we'll move on to the women. Go, go through, cover all the bases. Yeah. Well, I'm back. Daddy's back. The one you never had. God, enough. <laughs> just saying. Just saying. Just saying. Just saying. It's Team Star's fault. Hit me with the just saying, Zach. Kavos's channel is like dead. I got 50k views on a video Just from saying. 10 days ago. That's what I'm saying. He's like, he fell off plus ratio. Just saying. 
Well, now you just gave him content for another video. Yeah, that's okay. Nobody's watching. Well, they might if he clicks bait us. <laughs> yeah, the only video he has recently that has views is one with uh, Jake Paul in the thumbnail. Okay. <laughs> L ratio fell off <laughs> in real time on a YouTube channel. <laughs> Uh, don't I don't condone that. That's, I have no no part in that. Okay, so anyway, again, Keemstar who attacked my dad for being thirsty on Maine. Here's Keemstar being horny on Maine, and you tell me which one's worse. Keemstar, are you at least eighteen? I'll give you another chance. Nice boobs. Show me them on Skype now. How are you gonna compare that to? I will give you dick. Stop it. I'll beat it up, big titty. <laughs> Shh. You want? Would you want me to read one of these again, uh, Dan? I mean, just all of them. Like, <laughs> I will give you, you big. Stop it. <laughs> you better stop it, or next BKS will be in your butthole. Stop. I'm drunk, and you're using me for my Greek god sperm. <laughs> Share DNA. I'm down. Three way. I'm not yours to share. Quit being greedy, ho. <laughs> I'll lock you in seven rooms, ho. Get ready for that labyrinth R-word. Wow. Want to be the random sexy bitch on the BKS live stream tonight? Okay, now if you can just change your underwear, we would be getting somewhere. That's disgusting. Shut up, sluts. Tits or get the fuck out. <laughs> I'm, Sorry! I'm bored. Bored. Skype sex? I'm bored. Bored. <laughs> I'm bored. 3 a.m. Skype sex? You're lucky my fave slut gave me her blessings on your follow. 16 more? <laughs> Take a dick to the face, skink. <laughs> Let's make out C word. Can't even say it. Can't say that. Keem stars. Okay, whatever. Shut up or your mouth will get sperm. What? what? The f who talks like that? <laughs> Shut up or your mouth will get sperm. For years. Like, dude. It's a... <laughs> Just tell God. him to learn how to <clears throat> trick shot, then suck his dick. <laughs> you both suck that kick 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 keem star. Anyone from Denver going to be there all weekend? Fan meetup at Dave you and Buster's. You want this keem star cock. Mmm, please stop gawking my profile pic. I'm a, not, I'm a person, not a piece of meat. I would honestly love for my first... Wait. Just carry a condom around. Easy to conceal and great protection. Who does drunk op start? What is all this? Are we done tonight? Uh, if Kim... I will be pay playing with your boobs all night. <laughs> Just wait. So also like, using the N word, I mean, so like, so get like off the horse there. Sixth grade. I'm gonna play with your boobs all night. So here's a girl. She's coming to his fan meetup. Possibly twelve. I mean, who knows the age? Wait, let me go back up. Here, I mean, that. What's the age of that girl? Could He's, be fifteen. He said boner. <laughs> Boner! <laughs> Breaking news confirmed. <laughs> boner! Literally just boner! <laughs> oh, he's so, he's so, he's got such game, you know? He's so suave. It's no wonder boner that he, alert! It's no wonder the only people that will touch him are ones who are like literally, uh, <laughs> let's say, <laughs> have no experience in life. I don't know who like don't know any better. Show starts in 29 minutes. Retweet if horny. You are too. Don't lie. You coming on? I mean, my cock. I'm not easy, ho. So this is how long ago? These are old. But still. Yeah. Like. So we're Gary. So are my dad. <laughs> Nine exactly. years ago, or something like that. Well, you got to remember, he's like. So 40. he was exactly. So he was still 30 years old. You know. Yeah. Boner but alert. That's a 30-year-old <laughs> man. Uh, boner alert. Saying, boner. boner. <laughs> yeah, so, Keemstar, I mean, shut the fuck up. You're, by the way. Yeah. 
Keemstar, uh, shut up. Yeah, thank you. Shut Just up, don't... bitch! <laughs> <laughs> Cap that off. So that's about it. Good old fashioned shut up, bitch. What is this, AB? Just a little reminder of all the stuff he's tweeting about Eli. I mean, past the horror stuff. This is. Well, oh, I can't I play the audio? No so and this you clip bitch. you can't because he's just listening to uh, Hit Him Up by Tupac. Oh, and yeah. This is what he oh, posted yeah. at the time. It just says where I F's your bitch, you fat motherfucker. Yeah, I fucked your bitch, you fat motherfucker. Yeah, you sleep with 18 year olds, dude, because you can't get a real woman. So. And this is after, right after Ethy, uh, Leafy tweeted, this is not a joke. Keemstar just told me he slept with Ethan's wife. Mm -hmm. Cool. And then he put out and a bunch of other tweets. And he doesn't understand why people think he hates women or... Um, yeah, like you didn't have a choice in it. Or it's just like you're just yeah. this idol fuck doll that... Uh, yeah. Huh. Here, is Leafy's Hila on the other side of the bed? Leafy's yeah. a name I haven't heard in a while either. I wonder how his channel's doing. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, shit. And this... Don't give him content. He'll make a video on Instagram or something. <laughs> Facebook. What? <laughs> Facebook. Facebook. <laughs> yeah. To make a Facebook make video a about you, Dan. Okay.